Okay, everybody, uh, we're gonna put the belt on and the front variator. The, um, when you do that, you have to compress the rear clutch so that you can get the belt far enough, <clears throat> far enough forward so that the plates of the clutch meet together. If the belt is too far down, when you try to install the front cover on the variator, you have a tendency to get the splines off, and um, it's not a good, not a good thing. There was a um, picture of someone on um, Helix Group that I'm in, and um, I don't know if he did it or he bought it like that or whatever, but it the they're all smashed in. So to make sure you don't do that, let's um, put this front um, variator on and I'll show you how to do it. All right, let me get you set up here. If you look right here, You've only got that many, that much teeth showing, okay? So if, <clears throat> excuse me, if your belt is down in here, then it's gonna catch on the front plate and it's not gonna seat right. So the um, trick to that is this. Let me come around here. Yep, great. That's how my day's going. That is how my day's going. Okay. So, let's tell you that. You've got to grab a hold in here, in here. Squeeze this together. Did you see the belt go down? Belts further down in. Keep doing that as far as you can. <coughs> All right, so you can see it's down in there quite a bit. See how far up the belt's gonna ride when I put that plate on. So, and make sure your hands are clean and don't have any grease on them. Okay, so make sure the, see how you can hear it? Keep pressure on that. <coughs> see, I'm telling you, tell my day went all day at work too. All day at work too. Just great. I use just a dab of blue Loctite. Okay, got my washer on there. Nuts on there. This one's a 22. Mine's a 17 and a 19. This is my wife's rod. All right, see I picked the belt up? You can hear it? It's right up against there. Okay. <clears throat> That's it. <clears throat> Your belt's on there. Now, of course, you're going to have to start it to get the belt back to where it needs to be. So, that is our next step. Okay, as you can see, belt's tight again. And we know for a fact that that's seated up against there because we have the belt all the way out here. So, 
that's the way that you need to put your front variator and belt on to make sure that it gets seated on there. So doing a little maintenance, I put some slight bit of grease on the rollers in there and we're gonna um, have to order some rollers for, for this one. They get flat spotted and uh, being my wife's ride, we don't need to perform it out and put sliders on it and all that stuff, so. All right, well, um, once again, I hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoy the comments. I try to get back to you as quickly as I get them. So please subscribe, tell your friends, and um, hope this video helps you.